Hi friends, when you eat out at an Indian restaurant, chances are that they will have curry chicken on the menu. It's a popular North Indian dish that's made with a few freshly ground whole spices and is known for its incredible flavor. It's a simple spicy dish and is traditionally made in a cast iron wok. But you can use a Dutch oven or large saute pan instead. Karai just means wok. Therefore, Karai chicken translates the wok chicken. It's not the most creative name, but it is pretty straightforward. If I could rename the dish, I'd call it tasty chicken smoothed in a thick spicy tomato masala sauce made with freshly ground spices or something slightly shorter than that. While this dish is not as well known as a butter chicken, it's right up there in deliciousness. Karai chicken is more of a drier curry where the spice really cling onto the chicken. It goes really well with my baby nan roti recipe. We roast the whole spices, black peppercorns, coriander seeds and cumin seeds in a cast iron skillet over medium heat until the spices are fragrant. Coarsely grind and spices in a spice or coffee grinder and set aside. tomato puree we pour chopped tomato in a mixing bowl add ghee bay leaf and onions to a wok or dutch over pan medium heat and stir fry for 15 to 20 minutes or until the onions turn golden then add garlic ginger freshly ground spices and the remaining spice to the wok. Stir fry for a couple minutes then add the chicken. Once the chicken is coated with spices, add the tomato puree and then cover and cook for 10 minutes. Remove lid and add 2 teaspoon salt, 1 teaspoon Kashmiri chili powder, 1 teaspoon turmeric powder and 1 teaspoon garam masala. Then cook until the water from the tomato puree evaporates another 25-30 minutes stirring occasionally. At last, mix the ground spices and cook very well.